Sassy Sunshine 01. Hello everyone. Today is my first scent tester video for Candles by Victoria. And she sent me this candle. Um, it's colorless and labelless, well, nameless. And part of my job is to tell you guys my first impressions of the cold throw, the hot throw, which is when you burn the candle, like the scent throw of it. Um, and there's a little questionnaire that I have to answer. The candle, all together on a scale of 1 to 10, would be... I, I, I like it. I think I'd rate it like an, an 8 or a 9. Yeah. Okay, it says, what size candle did you test? Um, this is an 8 ounce jelly jar. Um, my initial thought, I wrote it, I wrote it down. Um, first impression of the cold throw was a strong bakery slash vanilla scent. And then, when I rubbed my finger, it released this orange zest kind of feel. And I am pretty sure it's orange and not lemon or some other citrus, but I could be wrong. And altogether, this candle as a whole reminds me of like an orange marmalade cake. <laughs> it's very sweet, but also very fresh and fruity. It's a fresh and fruity cake kind of smell. And um, when I was burning it, it gave off that same citrusy sweetness. The cold throne of the candle on a scale of 1 to 10, I would say probably about a, a 7. Like I can't, I can't hold it like way out here, you know. You have to be pretty close to it. But when I open the package, I could immediately smell it. So I guess maybe like an eight for that too. What size room? It's, it was a small room. It's my room. Uh, it doesn't have vaulted ceilings, and there's no fan or anything, because you shouldn't. You should have it in a draft-free room. How long? The first time, three hours, which is long enough for the melt pool to reach to the edge. And how long before the candle achieved a full melt pool? It took about three hours, I would say. At what point during the initial burning process did you begin to smell the candle? Um, I'd probably say within like 20 minutes I could come into the room and smell it. Uh, smell the candle scent. As the melt pool became larger, did the throw of the candle become stronger? I would say so. Yeah, I would say so. And I hope I hope it doesn't bother you that I'm going straight by the questions. I did, didn't really know what else I could do to it. What notes did you smell in this scent? Well, I, I kind of said it at the beginning, but I get bakery notes and fruity notes from this. It smells like... I think it smells like an orange mar if orange marmalade were to be incorporated into a cake, that's what it would smell like, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, definitely when I rubbed my finger it released the true scent of it. And it's very zesty orange zest scent with vanilla in it. Explain on a scale of one to ten how strong you feel the scent throw was. I'd say it was about like an 8. I think I give everything an 8. Um, I, I couldn't smell it um, from very far away in my small room, but it was it was a very good scent throw. Um, but I've, I have other candles from Candles by Victoria and they seem stronger to me. So maybe it's just this candle because most of my other candles are like 10s. And they smell the entire room, so maybe I should just burn it a little bit more, and um, it'll be fine. But right now it's about an eight. And uh, finally, would you purchase this scent? Why or why not? I think I would, and it's weird because I don't usually like citrusy things. I'm not a huge citrus person. I'm more of a an all the way bakery person. Like I love sugary things and stuff like that. But since it's a bakery kind of feel to it. It's got some notes of vanilla in it and a very sugary kind of scent, but it has citrus in it. I would buy it 
because I like sugary scents, even though I don't usually like citrus. This makes me like citrus. How about that? We'll say that. So hopefully in my time as a scent tester, I'll be able to test one or two more. So hopefully I did a good job. Victoria, Chelsea, and Matt. Um, I don't... <laughs> I'm kind of nervous about how you think of my scent testing. So Victoria also sent me a tart, a scent shot, um, in Butt Naked. <laughs> and it's a white tart. Um, that one, I wrote it down to, smells like magnolias and citrus. It's a crisp, clean, fresh scent. And I wrote down, <laughs> I'd want laundry to smell like this. <laughs> um, it's a very, very clean, f uh, light, it's, it's not even floral, it's just fresh. But I guess the magnolias part makes it floral, but I, I think I have a good feel for what magnolias smell like because we have a magnolia tree in front of our house. So. so yeah, I think it smells like magnolias and citrus. So there's a citrus trend, maybe that's like a hot scent right now. <laughs> but yeah, so just thought I'd give you a quick little idea of what Butt Naked smells like. You can buy it in the candle form, of course, or the tart. So that's the scent shot she sent me. <laughs> So yeah, this has been scent test video number one for Candles by Victoria by Sassy Sunshine Zero One, which is me, Soleil. I'll talk to you guys soon. Have a fabulous day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the scent shot. She's that's the scent shot. She's.